today's video is going to be very different. Next weekend, I start two seasonal gigs. The first one, earlier in the day, is face painting at a children's pumpkin patch. So much fun. Then, later in the evening, I will be scare acting at a very intense haunted house. So, I wanted to see how fast I can change my makeup from children's entertainer to scare actor. So I'm going to do a speed paint, but I'll let you know how long it takes to make the conversion because I obviously have a very small window of time between the gigs. So I've got to make sure I can get it right and get it done fast. So here's where we're going to start. It's a basic nozzle, nothing fancy, some white and black and uh, maybe a pink or red nose and some whiskers. Um, this is uh, actual black lipstick lip color. It's the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink color. This stuff does not go anywhere for hours and hours and hours. So I really like how long that lasts. Um, and also it's hard to get off in between um, looks. So when I'm changing, it's not going to go anywhere, but I can also stick it in my pocket if I need to reapply at the Halloween haunt. So this might be the general face look with sparkle black uh, cat ears, pop them on. I do have a full on black and silver sequin tuxedo jacket. And I do sometimes wear that with these ears and I go as a sparkle kitty. So black sparkle kitty maybe is doing the face paint today um, at the kids event. And just for extra sparkle, I might use these face gems here on my forehead. I have a bunch of these in different looks, but they'll definitely match the ears on top and peel off in one piece without leaving glitter all over the place because glitter at a Halloween scare is just not scary. Um, for eyes, I just threw on a bunch of black eyeshadow and I went underneath the eyes to give a little bit more kind of like, I don't know, smoky look or something, but that's gonna play into the Halloween look later on and adds to the black sparkle kitty for Halloween. So this is where we're gonna start. Let's see if we can get to Halloween and how long that takes. Okay, so the first thing, I will be wearing a one-piece sort of jumpsuit-ish outfit at the haunt. And uh, I'll be wearing a black hat and all that stuff. So kitty ears go on, hair will be up, and we will start scrubbing. So this is probably what I'm going to look like to start with if you were to see me at the haunt. Um, I'm going to have a jumpsuit on, a hat. I probably won't have a white t-shirt hanging out here, but maybe um, it might help with the makeup. But basically, I need a high impact thing that's going to startle you real quick. I'm in a jump scare spot, and then I have a spot where I can kind of slink away and hide as the other actors take over as the customers move through the space. So I just need something that's fast, high impact, catches your attention, and startles you. So that's what we're going for. Um, I don't think I mentioned it earlier, but I use blue squid makeup mostly. Um, it's water-based and it's super easy to get on and off, which is why it was so fast to hit that with the makeup wipe real quick. Um, so I have my water ready. I have uh, three colors ready and I'm going to do the speed paint here while I'm running the clock. So we'll see how fast the transformation actually takes. Okay, so here you go. There's a the look. Now, 
So questions that I will likely get asked, can I eat or drink with this makeup on? The answer is yes. Um, blue squid is non-toxic. So if any actually gets swallowed uh, as I eat or drink, it's not gonna hurt me. Um, also, that being said, most of the black around my mouth was that Maybelline um, Color Stay um, Super Stay. So this is not going anywhere. It's not going in my mouth. The white, however, is face paint. So just so that I don't mess it up whenever I am working, I will have a drink that has a straw and that will help. And this will last all night unless it starts raining or something and then I would get a little nervous. But that's pretty much that. Also, I'm fairly blind uh, without my glasses. So I can wear my glasses here and the dark color around the eyes. And since my glasses are black, I don't think they're really all that distracting. So when I pop out at you with my jump scare accessories, uh, hopefully this will just kind of catch your face real quick, give you a good scare uh, and send you on your way. What do you think?